Hey guys, this is Hugo Patrick Dolphin here, and today I'm gonna be doing a movie review. So for this movie review, I'm gonna be re be reviewing a, an an animated movie that was released in 2018 and was made by Disney Pixar. And the movie and the movie is a sequel to one of Pixar's um, best movies, and that is The Incredibles 2. So the plot of The Incredibles 2 is basically you have is that it start it starts out it starts off it starts off when and after the end, the end scene in the first Incredibles film back in 2004, and and it was when the Incredibles slash the Par family, the Par family, were defeating the Underminer, but they failed, and they also defeated with Frozone, which they both failed, and then later on, um, um, the the Par the Par family, and the other the Par family, the Par family and Frozone were 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 in. Were, were in a were invited to a place where superheroes were, like they were working on to bring superheroes back. I think, with um with a wealthy businessman named Winston Daver and and his sister Evelyn. So 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 the Parr family would so so the so Bob Parr, which is Mr. Incredible, um, Miss Parr, Miss, um, um, Elastic Girl. Which is Mrs. Incredible and Frozen. They went there, and then Elastic, and then they went to the to that this like to this pro to that program, and then Elastic Girl was chosen over Mr. Incredible, and then while Miss while Elastic Girl was was doing was was in the program was working to be a superhero, um, Mr. Incredible or Bob Parr was was struggling to be a new role, um, um, stay at home parent type thing. While he was helping his his son Dash with his math homework, um, um, her daughter his daughter is Violet's um, heartache over over her boyfriend Tony, I think, and Jack Jack, the baby who has superpowers in the film, like he like he was fine with a raccoon in the film. That was pretty nice. That was a pretty good scene. And while Elastic Girl was doing that, he was she was in. She encounters a super villain in the film, in the film, which is the screenslaver, who is who projects, who protects TV screens, and then, and then, Elastic Girl has to stop that, to stop it, that screenslaver, while while, the screenslaver while what's, while Bob, while Bob while Mr. Incredible and the and Frozen, and the other kids are at, are at home, so so basically. Elastic Girl was trying to do everything she can to be a superhero while Bob was at home being watching the kids, and so basically, um, basically the Incredibles have so basically, and then later on in the film, later on in the film, the basically the Incredibles have to defeat on who is the the, the screen sl slaver, and they they have to try to stop what's going on to that that superhero program that's run over, um, a the. Well, that's run over by Winston's sister, Eleven, Eleven, Evelyn. I mean, so yeah. So that's basically like the plot of The Incredibles two. So what do I think of it? In my opinion, I think The Incredibles two is an awesome sequel to The Incredibles, which is one of Disney Pixar's best anime films. Anime films, yeah. The voice actor did pretty good. Like everything did pretty good. The the story was good, and and the animation is great. And also, everything about this film was was awesome. So, The Incredibles 2 was an awesome film from 2018, and this film was one of Disney Pixar's expensive films, which expensive films, and the film made expense and the film made over a billion dollars in the box office, office, which is awesome, and I can't believe it made that much money on the box office. So yeah, if you have not seen The Incredibles, so yeah, The Incredibles 2 was a good film from 2018. So if you have so you've been wondering, so you, you you have been wondering, Hugo Patrick Dolphin, have you seen The Incredibles 2 in the theaters? And the answer is yes, I've seen The Incredibles 2 in the theaters on opening day as I saw Cars 3 in the theaters back in 2018 with my cousins and my sister. And we all get, went to see it back in 2018 in Cars 3 and back in 2017. So yeah, so if you have not seen The Incredibles 2, I highly recommend you watch it. It's an awesome film from 2018 and you're going to really like it as much as you did if you watched The Incredibles back in 2004. 
which I will be reviewing in Incredibles, the first Incredibles film, soon. So yeah. So if you have not seen The Incredibles 2, I highly recommend it. It's a great film. So Hugo Patrick, so you've been wondering, Hugo Patrick Dolphin, what will you rate The Incredibles 2? I will rate The Incredibles 2 a uh, 9 out of 10. It's a great film, and it was worth, it's an awesome film, and I think it was worth the wait for 14 years since The Incredibles, the first Incredibles film came out in theaters back in 2004, and 14 years later, it was in theaters. The se a sequel was in theaters, and also, and also, I think Plans for Incredibles Two was like over ten years before the film was released because I think the director Brad Bird was thinking about making a sequel to The Incredibles Two, um, to The Incredibles Two, um, um, when the release of Ratatouille came out, like Disney Pixar released a, an anime movie in two thousand seven called Ratatouille, which, which he, Brad, which Brad Bird directed it, the film, I think. And while Brad Bird was directing that film, he was thinking of making a sequel to The Incredibles 2. And, and 11 years later, it came out in theaters. And I think that 14 years, that 14 years of wait, of, of, of wait was worth it. And, and I think we have to wait another 12 years as of today. Because the movie came out two years later, and we have to wait another 14 years later. And 12 years later, which is in 2032. So hopefully The Incredibles 2... The Incredibles 3 will come out before 2032. Let's hope. Fingers crossed it will come out. So yeah guys, if you have not seen The Incredibles 2, I highly recommend it. It's a great film. And yeah. So yeah guys, that is it for this movie review. So I hope you guys enjoy this movie review. If you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, don't, for, don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to like the video, comment the video, share the video, and, and hit that subscribe button to see more videos of Hugo. Patrick Dolphin, and that is, and yeah, so that is it, you guys, and, uh, and I'll see you guys in the next video, so, goodbye everybody, and that's about it from Hugo Patrick Dolphin, and I'll see you guys in the next video, so, goodbye everybody.